Welcome to a sack for sore eyes. Last Saturday night, I got my D200 all gussied up along with myself and we went to a, a Christmas dinner hosted by my wife's employers. It was a great time. We had good food, really good conversation with some friends and the D200 was there to take pictures. So, do you think my D200 behaved itself? Well, I don't know. We should probably find out. You want to look at some pictures? You do? Alrighty then, let's get right to it. And so, hope you enjoy. enjoyed those pictures. We had a lot of fun uh, Saturday night there. It was, it was so nice to sit around and eat some good food and talk with good friends. And my D200 enjoyed it too. He enjoyed taking pictures, he told me one time a little bit later that night. So this is, this is how I had it set up uh, for pictures. I got my SB600 flash uh, mounted on the D200 camera and I had to experiment a lot because the lighting was uh, different there. The ceilings are at a minimum 20 feet high in some places so trying to use bounce flash like that off the ceiling was kind of an iffy, iffy proposition so I just went with it. I took quite a few pictures that with this camera, or it would have been with any camera that the flash wasn't right on them, so I had to experiment and change things. It went pretty good though, and we had a lot of fun. Everyone knew what I was doing, so you know they were all aware that I was taking these pictures. Now, this wasn't at all a controlled environment for taking pictures, and as a result, there was a eh, you know, there was a lot of horseplay and there was a lot of uh, things going on that kind of were disruptive to taking pictures but that happens every year and I kind of I kind of just roll with it like I said every picture here 
was taken with this setup except for one. The reason I go there, the reason I take a camera there for this one particular picture. And let me show you how I took that. So instead of the flash, I put on this Godox uh, X Pro uh, transmitter, put it on here, and then I go up on the balcony. I'm up on the balcony about, I don't know, 10 feet higher, maybe a little more than the group, and I shoot down on them because that's the only, only way I can get a, a, that big a group in the picture together and get everybody posed kind of good anyway. So I, after I go up there, I, I already have set up, I have this set up right here. So this is the last light softbox I've had for many years. And lighting it is two uh, Godox AD200 flash heads right here. And they're both set to fire simultaneously. And so this, this, this right here fires, fires the, uh, fires the flash unit, and so I can be anywhere in the room, and just all I gotta do is pull the, I shut the, the shutter speed and like that, and it goes off, and lights, oh, that it, that's bright, anyway, so that's what I use for this one particular, whoo, one particular picture. And I'm gonna, I'll put it up here right right now and then you can see which one I'm talking about. Now there's gonna be a lot of cropping going on on this picture. It's gonna be reduced down to four by six inches and it will go on a Christmas card for the, for the clinic. And we've been doing this, like I said, for a long time. So that was my reason for to having the camera other than taking informal candid shots. I printed one of the pictures out here as I normally do with this camera. So this was printed on Epson uh, Cold Press Natural, dang it, why can't I remember that? Cold Press Natural paper is 13 by 19. I printed it on my Epson P800 printer. And so here it is. I, this was one of the pictures that was in the, uh, the slideshow. This is my wife um, and then uh, two of the ladies she works with. The taller one is one of the owners of the clinic. Of the clinic. But that came out so nice. I mean, I, I like it a lot. And, and these three... I think those are the three original ladies that have worked at the clinic. I can't read, I think. The rest of them, they, they've changed. There's someone new there every year. Uh, anyway, it, it came out real nice and I'm real happy with that picture. I'll put it in my collection. The colors are real nice and, and it's really sharp too with this, with this setup. So yeah, that's, that's, uh, that was my night, Saturday night. We got home late. Whoa, he was it late for this old guy. But it was fun. And, and I hope you all enjoyed this. I've got another, uh, another idea in mind for uh, maybe a, I don't know, maybe sometime later this week, maybe next week. I can't, I can't guarantee anything. I kind of, depends on how much trouble I have. Anyway, hope you all enjoyed the video, and I'm sure glad you dropped by. I really appreciate it. So you guys all take care, and I'll see you at the next one. Goodbye.